if you were a really big fan of the chef race back in the day well you're gonna be really happy about what wargaming did right now they released a new game mode uh, that is basically the same as the chef race but you have three different vehicles and before i start talking anymore um, i'm gonna put the timestamp if you are already very familiar with the game mode and just want to get straight to the gameplay i'm gonna put a timestamp so just go to that time anyways so you have three different vehicles it is the t50 sport the leopard sport and the chaffee sport and they all have different uh, they're all good in their own way for example t50 sport is the slowest i mean slowest at 100 kilometers per hour but it has a uh, very good reload time it has very good ha uh, handling and very good acceleration the leopard on the other hand has a really strong this little autoloader and it's the fastest but it has very really low uh, handling and the chaffee is basically an all-rounder it's got a good gun that reloads a little bit it's got medium handling and it's got medium top speed out of all the vehicles uh, I found the Chaffee to be my favorite uh, when I was playing the Leopard, the Leopard was just sliding all over the place every uh, turn I had to take so I really enjoyed the Chaffee a lot more but the Outloader is really fun with this tank so I'm gonna be showing some live gameplay of the Chaffee Sport so let's see Okay, so this is a replay of a win I had. Uh, I couldn't quite... Uh, I did the live gameplay two rounds, but I lost both of them. And I would need to wait another half an hour to go more, because I assume this is the uh, wargaming anti-bot system, I would assume. But that doesn't matter. I just want to show a win, show an interesting gameplay video. So as you can see, it's a bit... Um, uh, you have to be very careful when to shoot your enemies. You can just shoot all the time and shoot walls and stuff. Because what happens is the barrier is too tall to shoot over. So you gotta shoot uh, the barriers that are red right here. So make sure to shoot your enemies when they are uh, at the red barrier as this leopard is doing and me so we're kind of sharing uh, fire right now but me and my teammates seem to be quite ahead uh, one of their uh, one of the enemies seems to be quite far behind and we're just kind of racing together right here and I was afraid we would it would get to like a mess up here where we would crash all together and slow all of us down. It seems like they did kind of start colliding a little bit. But it's all fine until here. We all just crashed together here. Me and this guy, the T50 Sport, we slowed down a lot. But luckily I used my overdrive and speed up uh, very quickly so right now we're just watching how uh, we are getting we're uh, over the half we're over halfway of the race right now and I believe there's a way at the start at least to uh, jump on the enemy lane because uh, I saw someone get on our lane like the first round I played uh, and that was something at the chaff races back in the day as well there was like many ways to get on the enemy track fairly quickly so right here you could see that uh, me and T50 hit each other but that's okay we managed to speed up and as you can see I'm just finding good opportunities to shoot that guy when I'm in the air so I can hit him or when there's a barrier and as you can see here the paths collide so no matter what you're gonna be with the enemies here 
And I was in a bit of a tricky situation because the leopard sport is a lot stronger, I feel, than the chaffy. And he's just slamming into my ass right now. And uh, uh, the first three people that get to the end get to repair. First one for 25%, the second one for 50 and the third one for 10 Whoa, did you see how that guy jumped? Oh, he came from up there, that's really cool. So I try to focus this T50 with my teammates. We all focus this guy, which is what you should do. And we were one second away from capturing, but because the other two had the cap points. But you should always focus the same, uh, the same person with your teammates to take out enemies as fast as possible, right? So we take out that guy, and then we just we just feast on this guy here. I am a bit low though, uh, and I I think I realized that soon, and I tried to hide a little bit. But the other guy comes to help real, <laughs> really nicely with ramming that guy. This guy gets stuck here and we just push him, ram him both. And that's an easy victory right here. And that's, that's, that's how quick rounds can go. It can last a lot longer actually, uh, if I'm honest. It can last a lot longer if at the end it comes to tricky situations when uh, there's like two people or something and one's really low you have to you have to hide somewhere behind the uh, containers or something right to not get uh, hit but the other person pushes you and stuff like that there's still a lot of strategy when it comes to the end of this uh, game mode but it is a really um, fun remake or a remaster of the Chaffy race with including two or, or three, I, sh I should say, different vehicles. Um, one being the Chaffy that was always in the match. Uh, I apologize because my voice is kind of gone, I'm a bit sick, but that doesn't matter. Anyway, uh, I really like this game mode. It's always fun to have something new in World of Tanks, as I always say. And the uh, game mode is available for 12 more days. It came out uh, yesterday, so you can get uh, very nice rewards, very nice camos and stuff like that, so make sure to get everything.